Good morning, Tay students. I'm Alani. And I'm Caroline. And this is Tiger, Tiger News. News. I hope you guys had a wonderful weekend. And it's the weather's looking nicer this week as well. But we'll hear more about that with Caroline with the weather. <laughs> and here's the weather and some exciting events for this week. First up with the weather, it's a, it's a little colder this week, but it'll be cloudy and maybe a little rainy. There will be a high of 49 and a low of 22. And there's a 40% chance of rain on Saturday. This Wednesday will be the warmest day of the week with a high of 49, and Friday will be the coldest with the, a low of 22. The days are also starting to get much longer now. As this week goes on, the sun will start setting even later every day at around 7 p.m. This means that the total daylight is increasing to just over 12 hours. Today is also the last day of winter. Tomorrow, March 19th, being the very first day of spring. Happy spring, Caroline. Thank you, Caroline, for the weather report. And now on to Iowa sports. Hey, what is up, Tenny Tigers? It's your girl, Aya, back again with another Tiger News video. Before I begin, make sure you guys like, subscribe, and hit that post notification bell so you can be notified every time we make a new video. Now, let's move on. Continuing with the topic of March Madness, don't forget that it's happening this week on Wednesday, March 20th. So if you're interested, you should maybe take a look at that. Also, did you guys know that baseball is starting up soon? The registration for Methuen Youth Baseball will, be, will also be starting up. That's what I like to hear. Who else? Did you guys watch the Celtics game last night? They beat the Washington Wizards 130-104, to making them 53-14, and 14, dominating the league. Anywho, that's all I got for y'all today. I hope you guys have a great rest of your week, and this is Aya signing off. ka -ching. Thank you, Aya, for the news about sports. And she mentioned that youth baseball is starting soon, but also professional baseball will be starting up soon with preseason. And then we have Alyssa with school events and school news up next. Hey guys, it's me, Alyssa Machado, back again with School News. This week at attending, we have a few important events, starting off with an NJHS meeting today from 2.30 to 3.30. Next up on Tuesday, there's a peer leaders meeting from 2.45 to 3.30. Also, today and tomorrow is the Methuen Scholarship Foundation Telethon. Make sure to donate to their Facebook page. This Wednesday, there will be an academic bowl meet from 2.45 to 3.45. By the way, this Wednesday is future freshman night. It's when all upcoming freshmen and their families are invited to learn about Methuen's program of studies and course selection. It will be at 6 p.m. at the Arthur Nicholas Auditorium located at Methuen High School. This Thursday, the Weather Woman is coming for all third graders from 10.15 to 11.15. Remember that there is going to be a book fair on March 25th all the way to March 29th. It will be during wind block, but your families are welcome to join in on the fun and shop after school on Wednesday the 27th from 4 p.m. till 7 p.m. Also, this Friday is the 7th and 8th grade dance from 4.30 to 6. And it's a half day! Make sure to tell your parents that school ends at 11.15 for upper school students and 11.45 for lower school students. Anyways, that's all the upcoming news, honey students. I'll see you again next week with another b, -b, -b banger obviously. Alyssa Machado, signing off. Capiche! <laughs> and, and that's it for today's video. And make sure to check out our March Madness. Don't forget that dance forums are due tomorrow. Anyways, we'll see you next time. Bye!